Hello everybody, my name is Melantra, and today we are playing a game called Amori. Now, because Amori is a story game, I'm going to be posting longer videos than what I normally do. And to add to that, this is also going to be my first playthrough, so I'm excited, and I hope you are excited to join me on this journey. With that, Amori. Welcome to White Space. Thank you. Thank you for the welcome. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. Oh, it's a styled game like this. Oh, this is cute. Oh, it reminds me of Pokemon. I'm currently playing Pokemon Fire Red. In the white space. I'm just going to follow this. Huh? Avoid the sperm hand. And I'm back. Oh, okay, so Z is to interact. A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? <laughs> do nothing. You stared at the door. You booted up your laptop. Oh, and there's and there's tissues right here. <laughs> What would you like to do? Stare at the screen, open your journal, or log off. Stare at the screen. You stared at the screen. Open your journal. Today, I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today, I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today, I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. What would you like to do? Log off. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Yes. It's number five. What's what's that one on the right? One, two, three. That's it. <laughs> Meow. Waiting for something to happen. And something has happened. Something fell nearby. What fell nearby? Oh! You got a shiny knife. No! It's just a fucking loop. I got a knife now. Let's try the door. A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Open the door. Let's go! We are now out of white space. Hi, Mori. We were hoping that you'd come by. Hi, Aubrey. Do you want to play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Hooray! Cards! Oh. Whoops. Never mind. No! Cards! Oh, man. What the heck, Arb Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game, after all. Don't give me that hero! You only say that because you were losing. Yeah. I do the same. Is that an egg? That's an egg on the floor. They have an egg on the floor. Why is there an egg on the floor? Go to the watermelon. You got stuffed toy. A tentacle is poking out of the ground. Would you like to make toast? <laughs> yeah, I like to make toast. You made toast. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. A neatly wrapped present. A blender. All very, very, very interesting items. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know the other day that good for nothing stole my stuffed toy and hit it. The watermelon interested me. 
and I wanted to see why it was there, and I accidentally found the fucking stuffed toy. That good for nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. How'd you get a stuffed toy in the watermelon in the first place? I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Armori? Pretty please? I've, I've, I've got it. It's in my hand. It, is that... Could it be? Aubrey snatched a stuffed toy from you. Hey, Carol. Look, it's my stuffed toy. What the heck? Where did you get that? Amori found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Serves you right, Kel. You should know better than to pick on others. Yeah, Kel! But Aubrey started it. She was the one who was making fun of me for the mole on my... On your... What? On his butt! Just say it. Say it, Kel. Just say it's on your ass. Aubrey. Fine. Hey, Amori. I'm glad that's all settled. Those two always seem to be bumping heads. Mary and Basel invited us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? Yeah, more characters. Mary and Basel. All right, everyone. Let's go see Mary and Basil. Oh yeah, fresh air at last. Gotta love that nature. Well, let's go. Hey, wait a sec. This game's so cute so far. Help me guys, I'm stuck. Only if you say please. Kel, stop messing around and get me the fuck out of here. Okay, okay, fine. Took you long enough. Well, sorry, princess. Mary! Basil! It's Mary and Basil! Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again. Oh no, not again. How could he? Yeah, Kel. How oh, fuck, how could you? I'm not being mean. Aubrey's just being all whiny. Well, Kel, you've just made a very convincing point. Now, I don't know who to believe. <laughs> believe me! No, believe me! Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? <laughs> Chin up, hero. Look at you, being our responsible. I really like that about you. <laughs> Come on, Mary. Mari. Mary? Not now. Oh, hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. While we were waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through his photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this. Oh. Come on, Basil, take a picture of me. Sorry, Kel, I only take the photos of people when they least expect it. Okay, so Basil is the one with the flowers. You like to take photos of people acting naturally when they're not in front of a camera, right, Basil? <laughs> yeah. There's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there. <laughs> yeah, I guess you can put it that way. Sure, I can do that. Did you want us... Did you want to show us your photo album up? Did you want us to show it? Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? 
Ah, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop doubting yourself. I'm sure that will be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry. I'll try to believe in myself more. Here. This way we can all see. This is so cute. Oh, I can read it. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy. Aubrey has some seeds on her face. Maybe someone should tell her. I love this. All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet are whose? Me. It's so cute. These photos are all so charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Hey. I didn't take all of them, though. Mari likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did y'all want to come hang out at my house? Did y'all all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure. That sounds fun. Let's go! It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Hmm. I think I'll sit this one out. You all go on and enjoy yourselves. But if you... But if you're ever feeling weary, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. And you can even save using my picnic basket. Oh, thanks, Marie. You're always doing so much for us. Bye, Marie. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Can I go on the slide? Hey, wait just one second. Where do y'all think you're going? You can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. The more the merrier. Y you want to play hide and seek again? But you know how this turned out last time. Y yeah. Sorry, Burly. I think we're going to have to pass. We're going to Basil's house now, so we'll catch up with you later. Not so fast! You guys are- you guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? Is it my face? My rough and tough exterior? At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I banned him from the playground after what happened last time. I wonder what that moron is up to now. Eh. Good riddance. So, you want to play hide and seek, Basil? I can go either way. There's no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it to Amori. What do you want to do? Amori, Amori, my best friend. You know how to play hide and seek, don't you? I've never played hide and seek in my life. That sounds like a very complicated game. I don't think I should play because I, I, I don't know how to play hide and seek. How does one play hide and seek? No, I don't know how to play hide and seek. Uh, you don't know how to play hide and seek? What kind of kid are you anyway? I'm just a kid who's never played hide and seek. That means you have to play with us. I'll explain the, I'll explain the rules after I round everyone up. I, no! All right, maggots, here's the rules. We're gonna be entertaining ourselves with a little game of hide and seek. Here in my hands, I got some straws, see? Everyone here has gotta pick a straw. The one with the shortest straw is gonna be it, and we'll have to find everyone else. Sounds easy enough, right? We all got our straws? Good. Now let's see who's gonna be it. Well, 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 it's me, isn't it? Looks like the one with the shortest straw is- It's me, isn't it? Amori! I fucking knew it. Wait, oh wait. Amori is it? But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you gonna be okay, Amori? I can take your place if you want. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. 
The straws make the rules, not me. Come on, don't be babies. It ain't so bad. Amori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk to the tether pole and close your eyes. And no peeking, or else. Alright. Five, four, three, two, one. Go! I didn't peek. Oh, easy. Whoa, you found me. Now I can help you find everyone. Just don't tell Burley about this. Got it? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, you found me. Darn. Hehe. <laughs> Let's go find everyone else together, Amori. This sand wasn't here before. That's a straw. I see you. There's a straw on the ground. Pull it out? Yes. <laughs> Took you guys long enough. I thought I was gonna suffocate in there. How'd you like my hiding spot? Pretty good, eh? It looks like you pretty much found everyone else too. Unexpected, but I like it. Let's do a final roll call. Basil! You can come out now. You already won. Hello, Basil! Hey, there's Basil. Basil, are you okay? Are... Are you stuck? <laughs> Boss, I should have known it was you. You good-for-nothing scoundrel. Let Basil go. Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil is our friend. Don't you dare hurt him. Let go of Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> you stupid edge! You think this is about Basil? Don't play dumb. You know why I'm here. How dare you not invite me to hide and seek? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. You're not even playing it right. How can you call it hide and seek without any body slamming? My flower crown. Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. How could you drop her fucking crown? Let go of him, you bully. No. If I can't play with everyone, then no one can. This is a boss only zone now. And you're not invited. Oh, there's actual fighting. What will Amori and friends do? This isn't fair. Rematch! I want a me rematch! Should have kicked him in the balls. But still, are you hurt? Oh, don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Boss, it must hurt to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Yeah! There. Does that feel better? Basil, are you sure it's okay to do that? Boss is bad news. It's a good thing Amori held on during that final attack or else we would have all been toast. It's okay, I trust him. When you were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? <laughs> that's, a, that's a load of baloney. I don't need to hear these lies. This is my spot. No one is welcome here. Well, probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can go to Basil's house now. That sounds good to me. Let's go to fucking Basil's house already. We're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Now, what I expect to happen is for this to be like a Doki Doki Literature Club, where it starts off slow and it's super cute, and then you're sad and you feel betrayed. And all you want is Monica. Hey. You. Yeah, you over there. It's the mailbox! Um, Amori? I think that mailbox is talking to us. Maybe you should go check it out. 
Yes, yes. Hello, Valley Cusper. Welcome to my ship. Please, buy anything. What do you got, Mr. Mailbox? You got candy, apple juice, and jacks. <coughs> Apparently better than orange juice. No! No! Orange juice over apple juice. Orange juice over apple juice. Orange juice is top tier. Apple juice has nothing on orange juice game. This is where I uninstall you. Let's go to Basile's house. Is this Basile's house? That's not Basile's house. Oh, these plants are dying. Can I water them? These flowers are called my l Lily of the Valley. It's said that they're able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Marie. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. That's so cute. Oh my god, jump scare. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the jump, but I wasn't expecting the sound that caught me off guard. Whoa! What's that ugly plant creature? Don't you know, Kel? That's a sprout mole. Sprout moles are highly intelligent creatures, but become dangerously vicious when they are lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop that. You're stomping over all my flowers. Oh, Sprout Mole, you fucking douche. You douche. Ah, it looks like the Sprout Mole is angry. Like us, Sprout Moles also feel emotions. You think I care if you're angry? No. No. I don't care if you're angry. Amori's party was victorious. Ah, most of the flowers are unharmed. That's a relief. Hey, Amori, now that you, we're getting a hang of battling, here's a journal where you can keep track of neat foes we come across. Hero gave you the faux facts journal. There, now it's in your pocket. The journal is yours to record with, but might pitch in sometimes too. Check it in your pocket with inventory with X. Cool. Bro, where's your house? Why is your house? Oh no, not again. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, start stop twirling. You're destroying all the flowers. Wow, Sprout Moles are assholes. We seem to be running across a lot of foes with emotion. In case you didn't know, emotions can determine how strong or weak an attack is. Happy beats angry, angry beats sad, and sad beats happy. So happy is stronger than being angry. And angry is stronger than being sad. That would make sense. It's like a whole Pokemon thing. Angry beats sad. Yeah, I'm angry and I'm gonna beat the fuck out of this sad dude. I don't know how sad beats happy. How does, how does sad be happy? I don't understand that. Hi, everyone. You all came just in time for a lovely picnic. Feel free to rest here. Everything is already set up, and I even brought some fruit. How, how, how did you get here faster than we did? You and your friends feel like new. Me, me, me. Who? Thanks, Marie. You're the best. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just trying to look out for all of you. Aw, oh, Maria, I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. That's not true at all. It just seems that way from the outside. Either way, you sure seem to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Maria is so effortlessly, effortlessly graceful. Don't you think so, Amori? Yes, I, I didn't know I was supposed to make a decision. I just accidentally clicked it. Aw, oh, but I selected yes. I guess I have to believe it a little bit if all of you think so. My house is right down this way. Are we all ready to go? I'm ready when you are. We'll catch up with you later, Marie. Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. <coughs> she said she was going to sit this one out, but still on the way to the goddamn house. Who's here? Giant Sprout Mole! After you, release energy. Mori and friends come together and use their ultimate attack. Takes 300 damage! The power of friends! 
Sure. I couldn't have done it without my friends. To my friends, it was fun. It was fantastic. Thank you for being by my side, my friends. Because of you, Amori's party was victorious. And there you have it. Heroes Battle Royale Tutorial 101. And I'm sure that as we fight more battles, our teamwork will improve over time. Wow, you guys. That was so amazing. Ah, oh, that was nothing. I've taken down way bigger guys than that. I should teach you some of my skills one of these days. But still, I know you're not the type that likes to fight. But it's good to know how to... It's good to know how... It's good to know how to defend yourself, too. I cannot read. You know... I've actually been working on a book all about battles. Maybe we can all study together next time. I'll give it to Mori to hold on to for now. You get self-help guide. As we get stronger, I'll be updating the follow-up section of this self-help guide. Be sure to check it every now and then. Amori, you should know. When we gain EXP and level up, sometimes we'll also learn skills. Skills are powerful and have a wide range of effects, but each of us can only remember up to four skills at a time. It's Pokemon. It's Pokemon. After you learn a new skill, don't forget to equip it from the player menu, okay? Yeah, yeah, we know. Can we go to Basil's house now? Yeah, can we fucking go to Basil's house now? Basil's house. Basil's house. What a nice house you have, Basil. Say cheese! Oh, it came out kind of blurry. Well, that's okay. That gives it character. Hope you don't mind the photo. Of course we don't mind. I want to see it. Uh, oh, sure thing. We all look so cute. How's my hair? I want to see. I want to see. Huh. Oh, hey, Amori. Did you want to look at the photo, too? Adorable. It's too bad that it came out kind of blurry, but you all still look so cute. I should add it to my collection. Woohoo, another shot for the photo album. Move over, Aubrey. I can't see. Hey, stop pushing. You already had your turn. Get out of my way, Kel. Wait, wait, hold on. There's no need to fight. Me first. No, me! Wow, such children. Such fucking sissy babies. Ah, stop it. You guys are knocking me over. Y'all are gonna hurt Basil! Uh, whoops. Oh my gosh. Basil! I'm so sorry. Are you okay, Basil? <clears throat> you two are in big trouble now. This is why the both of you need to learn how to get along. I'm sorry, we didn't mean it, Hero. Please don't tell Marie. It's okay, don't worry about it. Accidents happen. Don't pick them up by yourself, Basil. Here's your photos. It doesn't look like any of them got damaged. Let's put them back in your photo album together. Thank you, Hero. Let's go inside my house first. Remember to watch your... <clears throat> Remember to wipe your feet before you come in. Basil lives inside of a shoe. Basil li literally lives inside of a shoe. Can I save at the candle? No. Bunch of potted plants and flowers. Basil loves taking care of things. Are you ready to put the back the photos, Amori? Yes. Yay, let's get started. Hmm, darn. I don't think I remember the order of all these photos. Don't worry about a thing, Basil. Amori has a really good memory, so I'm sure we'll figure this out in no time. Do I have a good memory? Was I supposed to have a good memory? My bad. Uh... 
Uh. Oh. Uh. I, I didn't know I was supposed to have a good memory, honestly. And this one goes... Oh, uh, is it doing it for me? How fucking lame. Don't do it for me. There. Good as new. It did it for me. Didn't it? Yeah, I promise to never fight with Aubrey ever again. Unless she starts it first. Don't worry about it. I know you only wanted to see my photo album. Thank you for helping me put it back together. Hmm? That's strange. A photo must have been loose. Huh? What is this? Did I take this photo? Something about it seems... so familiar. N no That can't be. Marie! She's... Oh. She's... She's what? Ah! 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 Sperm head! Get away from me, sperm head! Get away from the sperm head! Get away from me, sperm head! Bro, what? Is everything the same? Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Now, after we did chapter one, does any of these mean anything? This wasn't there before. That wasn't there before. I remember last time I couldn't go through everything. It stopped right here. I remember that much. Meow? Not much to do around here, is there? Oh, right. I have this stuff. Is there anything I'm missing? Stab? Stab who? Skills? Select two? Always deals a critical hit. Ignores defense when Amori is sad. It's the only thing I can do. Look at all of us. These are all of our memories together. They're a little sad now. But we should be happy that they all happened at all. Let's make some new memories together, okay? Okay. Let's make new memories together. You see a boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? Oh, let's go! Millie. The boy's name is Millie? Yes. Oh, I can move. An old computer. Mom's voicemail. Hey, Millie, it's Mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. Did you finish packing yet? The movers are going to be at our house in a few days, so I have... So I left a list of things for you to do before they arrive. Also, sorry, Mommy messed up. I forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few extra days before we're ready to move, so the lights might cut out sometime tonight. Anyway, I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve-wracking right now, but I think a change of scenery will be a positive for both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but you might want to say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Cal has been trying really hard to get a hold of you ever since we put our house up for sale. He's been calling us every week for the past few months. Oh no, we've moved away from our friends. 
He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. I love you, Mommy. Bye, honey. You are hungry. I am hungry. Are you sure you want to go downstairs? The kitchen might be... No, the, yeah, the kitchen's downstairs. No, let's look at the other rooms first. <clears throat> A bathtub. Some towels and toiletries. Mom's sticky note. Hi, Millie. This is a note from Mommy. Remember to brush your teeth every day. Love you, XOXO. I want to look at the other rooms first because I am a natural explorer. This bookcase has been cleared out. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? I knew it would be smart to look at all the other rooms. I fucking... Why is there a picnic basket in my mom's room? Mom, why do you have a picnic basket in your room? All right. All right, guys. So we are going to call it here. As I said in the beginning of the video, I don't want to push the video too long because it's already going to be longer than what I usually post on... However, if you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. As always, it does show that I am making the content that you enjoy. And I do plan on playing this game more because I want to see what happens in the story. I want to see why it's so dark. I want to see why there's a discretion at the beginning of the game. I want to see it. And I hope that you join me on that journey. But until then, remember to stay you, stay true, stay beautiful, because that's exactly what you are, is beautiful. Till next time.